The fight over a new African-American studies class that's not being allowed in Florida schools is going to court. A group of students and elected officials say that they are planning to file a lawsuit against the state for banning the course. Sanaka Dange has new reaction this morning after the college board said that it would update the curriculum. Sonica? Yeah, a lot has happened, guys, with this controversial class just in the last 24 hours. So we'll begin with yesterday afternoon when the College Board announced it will release the official framework for AP African American Studies next week. This will replace what's called the pilot framework, which was used to test the course in several schools across the country. The Florida Department of Education's decision to not allow the class in our state was based off of that framework. It said the class lacked educational value and violated Florida law. In a new statement released last night, the department says it is glad the board recognized the original curriculum was problematic. It went on to say that it looks forward to reviewing the changes and expect the removal of content on topics like critical race theory. But there is still outrage this morning over the state's initial decision. The NAACP accused the Department of Education of, quote, whitesplaining black history and culture, saying its decision to restrict the class is a dangerous politicization of the curriculum. Civil rights attorney Ben Crump has also joined the conversation. He's expected to be in Tallahassee today, where he says he will work with AP students from Florida to file a lawsuit against the state for rejecting the class. We'll of course be watching for that announcement and we'll bring you any new details right here on WESH 2.